hello welcome to my channel my name is joy and this is joining with joy if you are new yet thank you for stopping by for returning viewers thank you for always watching to all my subscribers thank you for helping build this channel we are at 704 subscribers and i couldn't be more happy thank you thank you for all the comments and like please continue to like comment and share the video uh today video we are doing the house tour finally <laughs> finally it's happening uh i will do it in a two-part series just because it's been difficult for me to upload long videos so i don't want to make it too long i will do just the inside of the house right now and then i'll do the bedrooms another time and then we'll do the outside but i am excited to do this uh please like comment subscribe and on a side note, if you are in Liberia and you are using your debit or bank card, credit, whatever type of card you are using, especially with the GT Bank POS, if they tell you it declined, please, please double check your card. Because it happened to me about three or four times now. Even though they said it declined, they still charged me and I had to go back there to get a refund. So please, if you use your bank card or credit card, and they tell you a decline, double check your card to make sure it didn't actually go through. Because most times, even though it said a decline, they actually did charge you. So that is just a side note and want to make you guys aware of that. Uh, please enjoy the video. Like, comment, subscribe. Hope everyone is having a great weekend. Stay blessed. Love you all. Thank you. Okay, we are finally doing this house tour. How about it? This is the entrance of the house. Uh, we are going through the front door. This is the entrance way. I know the thing over there, I do want to get like a picture frame to cover it up. But that is basically what control the water system. The bigger one over here is used to pump water into the uh, water tank. And then the smaller one, once you turn it on, it makes the water that flows through the house to go fast. So it's not like so. Uh, when they put it in, I don't know what I was thinking. I didn't realize it was at the front of the house until they got done with it. And I saw how messy it looked. But I do plan on getting like a picture frame or something to cover that up. This area is the entryway. I want to put like an entryway table over there with maybe a mirror or a big picture frame of the family. I don't know yet. I'm still trying to figure out how I want to decorate this place. But I don't know what it is. But we got the living room car, the living room set from Liberia. We bought it in Liberia. I do have a video from a while ago as to where I got the living room from, chair from there. I have really nice furniture there. I bought my living room set, my dining room, and my bedroom set for them. The center table and coffee table we got in the U.S. at Slumberland. The TV stand we got it in the U.S. Uh, the speaker sound, the speaker something over there, we got it in the U.S. We have been having trouble getting uh, Internet in here, so we decided to get DSTV for the time being. That way, we have something for entertainment since we don't have home internet yet. This, we got the curtains. I got them for a different couch that I wanted to get originally, but then I got this one, so now it doesn't match. I'm still finding to find, the, I'm still trying to find the right couch that I like for this area. The living room and the bar is basically an open space. So after the living room, there is the bar. The bar was built by a Liberian carpenter. He did a really good job. He did the bar and he did my bedroom closet. I don't have any problem with his work. It was really great. The uh, wood he used is really thick and sturdy. It just looks really nice. The picture doesn't even do it justice. It's really nice and it's a good work if you do want his information let me know i will ask the contractor for that information for you the lights over the bar we got it from city builder i think they were like a hundred hundred and five dollars or something around that the ones in the living room we got it for fifteen dollars at eco electric so 
I still gotta get past to and obviously change the curtains. The picture on the wall, uh, Liberian printer did it. It's actually on wood and they just printed the picture on it. It is nice. I wish they had like a bigger size, but that's the biggest size they have right now. If they had a bigger size, I would have probably got the one done and then just put it in the middle between these two lights. So I'm still working on what's gonna go there. Uh, this is the dining room. Like I said, this we got the curtains. Still decorating. It's not done yet. Still got a lot of work to do. But this is the dining room. I do want to put like a black wall under the table. And the like I said, the dining room set we also got from the same place we got the living room set. It is really nice. I love the white and the black. It comes together so nice. Same thing with the cabinet. But all of the dishes, we got them from the U.S. The dining room opens up into the kitchen. As you all know, this is the famous kitchen. I love it. Uh, it's one of my favorite ways. I do want to put an island in the middle over there. Uh, that way I have more space. My husband said I would, I would be filling up the kitchen too much, but I really do want to have it. So I'm probably going to do that next. All of the appliances for the kitchen, we got it in the U.S. And another thing, I bought my furniture, my appliances little by little. So like when Best Buy was on Thanksgiving sale, I bought it. Like the all the appliances in the kitchen, I probably bought them like three years plus before we moved. So whenever I have extra cash, I will buy something for the house. Whenever I have extra cash, I buy something for the house. That way, it was trying. I was trying to reduce the expensive. But uh, this is the kitchen. There's not much to show, but I really do love it. That's the pantry room over there. We did put a television in the kitchen. Once I put in the island, then I will probably start using that. But. I love to cook and follow recipes, so I thought I could put one in there. That way I can watch my YouTube videos for recipe on there. So far, this is it for the, in, basically the open part of the house. I will, like I said, do another video showing the rooms and everything, but please like, comment, subscribe enjoy the video hope everyone is having a great weekend stay blessed thank you for watching thank you for subscribing to the channel it is nice to have you guys on there thank you thank you thank you so much for joining the family have a great day